This is it. This is the final video on the road to part 50. I kind of said it as a joke originally, but to be honest, Dumbest Tweets is out of my hands now. I am nothing but an empty shell whose job it is to give you guys the latest and uh, greatest what? from the land of dumb Twitter. I don't know. If that's my purpose in life, then I will take it gladly. If this is your first Dumbest Tweets video, I'm sorry, but I'm about to steal about seven and a half hours of your time. Once you watch one, you have to watch them all. That's just how it goes. Here we go then. My name is Danny yeah. Burke and this is the top 10. Dumbest Tweets, part 49. Starting off at number 10 now, we have someone saying, I swallowed an ice cube yesterday and I haven't pooped it out yet. <laughs> Excuse really me, what? You guys. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> It goes Whatever to water, you with. idiot. That's a very good point. I've yeah. never swallowed or eaten ice, and I had it come out the other end. Where is it going? It's a mystery. And the same thing yeah, happens when go I out. ice in my pocket. It doesn't go out that way. Later Good. The day, it's and it's always liquid. gone. There's just water there. <laughs> I think the two mysteries are somehow related. Let me know if you guys have any theories. Together we can crack this one. Coming in at number nine now, we're asking, if you had a heart transplant, would your memories go away? Oh. Well... Let's think about that. There's about 5,000 That is so sad. He's got Dory in the background. a lot of people walking around with no memory. Yeah. Or, uh, don't you oh mean they get the memories word. of the person whose heart they received? Now, to be fair to this person, I have heard some stories about people taking on certain traits of the person whose heart they now have. Some people even start craving food that that person used to crave in life. Memories, though, I don't know. I don't know about that. <laughs> Moving on to eight now, we're saying, question, are the blue parts of a map the sky or the water? Oh! <laughs> really? 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 You think the Dumb blue butt. on a map is to show the sky? I mean, what? How would that even work? Uh. Do you think there's no sky over the land then? Because I live on land. I think I think we all do, and we can all see Where the sky. Where has humanity gone? Where has humanity gone? Added in this tweet. It's going to need a bunch of people to figure this one out. Apparently, just in case anyone out there is actually confused by this tweet, there is no such thing as a sky map, unless you mean like the night sky, and then that's a whole other different thing. Don't let this person hey confuse now. you. The blue bits on a map are always water. Never thought I'd have to say that. Do you know what? We're actually going to continue with the whole map theme here at number seven now. Uh -oh. We're saying whenever I see a map of the world, all the countries are on one side. How come they never show the other <laughs> side of the map? If anyone That's has a why it's of called the other a map. Side, please send links. Uh, Thank you. Yeah, you probably I don't think Dorothy Explorer is going to help with that person. You could possibly say about a map. Think again. No. This person actually thinks there's a whole other side of the world that we're not seeing on the other side of the map. Imagine meeting someone from a the country map is that you'd never heard of. Out version and just like, of the world. Oh, yeah. You probably haven't heard of it because yeah. it's on the other side of the map. Next time you have a map, just flip it over and you'll see where I come from. What have these videos come to? What what? That's my question. What am I talking about? Moving on now to number six. We have a very important life lesson here. This person tweeted, so a credit card is just free money. Wow. I get good. I almost feel the pain that they're gonna feel when they realize how this whole credit card thing really works. Credit cards oh my God. are free money. Is that crazy? Is, is that person, like, really is that person like five or something? Do, but they make you Good pay Lord. it all back. And they charge you even more money if you don't pay it back right away. But yeah, technically, other than that, it's free money, sure. Next up at number five now, we're saying, I hate grapes, they disgust me. How is that My stupid? My first thought was actually what this Dude, person she replied spelled with. Disgust, what he saying? not disgust. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, disgust. Like, stupid. It's, it's disgust. like, it's like it, they, they, they said similar. it as if you're having they a really discussion. They really do have different meanings. If some grapes no. disgust uh, you, that's fine. But if they disgust you, well, I think someone might have slipped something in your grapes because that's not a normal thing to see your grapes just sitting there talking about you. Especially if they're saying mean things. Nobody likes a sour grape. Oh, boo. <laughs> oh, God. Can we move on here? Moving on now to number four, we're saying, yes, I'm vegan. Yes, I eat meat. We exist. Okay. Okay, that's Amazing. not how vegan Some of you guys works. may have no. seen this one before. It pretty much went viral. People were coming up with their own versions like, yes, I'm atheist. Yes, I believe in God. Yes, we exist. Yeah, that's... Just stuff that made as as much a sense Christian, the original tweet. As a Christian, I completely understand tweet. that. Oh, my word. If this person has found a way to eat meat and still be vegan, 
They may have made the biggest discovery of this century. If anyone is watching this in like 50 years from now, you may already have animal flesh that was grown in a lab or something. So technically, it's not animal meat as we know it, but we're living in your past and this tweet just makes absolutely no sense to us, as do most of them if I think about it. Next up at number 3 now we have this tweet from Ninja. He posted a picture of him with his partner before they went to the game awards. That's an a actual lot of his fans YouTuber were blind, I think. But this one yeah, it is. Let's go see what he's Someone happened. asked if his wife is single. Are you kidding me? This doesn't need any explanation from me. <laughs> this doesn't even need any reply from you guys. We just have to acknowledge Her that husband this is, is right there, you team. idiot. Move on with our lives and hope one day people will understand the words like husband and wife don't really match you are a dumb ass like single we'll get there one day oh. number two we are asking do any other twins get memories confused <laughs> <laughs> this one had me confused at first but i think what they mean is do any twins think oh, they have work. a memory but then they How realize is... the memory actually belongs to the what other twin what happened here i mean i've heard a lot of interesting things about twins being connected but thinking you have one of their memories. If two people both experience something, then maybe one person's account ends up informing the other's memory. But if they did different things, they're not gonna remember that as their own memory. Or, or are they? I can't remember nope. now. I'm sure I saw that somewhere. Maybe it was someone else's memory. And finally now, I'll number see. one, we're tweeting, what the f what's the number for 911? Really, dude? <laughs> I think, uh, I think what I'm going to say. 911, what's your emergency? Really uh, I don't know what the number for 911 really is. Simple numbers. Really, dude? Them. In no. the UK, it's 999. I know in the US and Canada, it's 911. These are very easy numbers to remember. When someone says call 911, you really don't have to look much further to find the number for it. Maybe they live in a place where the police are actually called 911. <laughs> Maybe that number is just a lot harder to remember. Yeah. Let's just uh, say it's that, guys. That way we can end the video with a little bit of faith in humanity. That's nice. All right, that was part 49. It's done, it's over. There is now literally nothing stopping us from part 50. I think I started the hashtag road to part 50 over a year ago now, and here we are. We are just one video away from 500 dumb tweets. I can't believe it, but also, I kind of can believe it. There are a lot of dumb tweets out there. You just have to find them. Let me hear you all commenting hashtag road to 50 if you want that. And also let me know which part was the first dumbest tweets video you ever saw. Maybe it's this one. Okay, time for a remember. quick comment. This one came from my top 10 scariest family secrets video. If you haven't watched that one, check it out. It was actually one of the most interesting ones I've done in a while. I couldn't believe how dark some of the family secrets out there were. I asked you guys to share some of your own and I definitely got some. If chance said, when I was a baby, my father murdered my mother. Growing up, I lived with my mama's parents and my father's parents had visitation rights. They lived in a different state but came to see me a few times. I was told they stopped coming to see me because they were both ill, but I found out that the two of them tried to kidnap me and drive me to their home state. There was an Amber Alert out for me and that's why they stopped seeing me. I was told this 14 years later and on my birthday. Wow. If Jack, well, that raised I a creepy scale a bit. So sorry that happened to you. Honestly, that sounds like it must have been really, really hard for you to experience that. But even just from your comment, I think you sound like a pretty solid and well-rounded individual. Big props to your grandparents on your mum's side well, for looking after you quickly. for all those years. I had a look at some yeah. of the comments, guys, but... I don't know, it didn't really feel right putting anything after this. Thank you to everyone who commented though. Make sure you do the same on this video if you want to appear in a future I like comments it. segment. Thanks as always for watching guys. My name is Danny Burke and I will see you all in the next one. That's it. Oh my, oh my word. Hey guys, it's um, Agent Marco here and I'm with Ryra99 here. What's up? So, um, <laughs> I had an awkward pause there. <laughs> Did you not hear me? I said, what's up? <laughs> yeah, I kind of glitched out. Anyway, that was Top 10 Dumbs Tweets Part 49. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? Is this where our culture on Twitter has gone to these days? The worst one ever. Is your wife single, Ninja? What the frick? <sighs> Uh, her husband is standing right there. Exactly. That's almost like that's almost like saying like, 
Like, hey, man, your girlfriend. She's single. That's not how it works. That reminds me of ASDF. <laughs> exactly. But it's, either way, that was just an example. But seriously, if you guys have any, what was the, your, I don't know how to say it. What was the funniest dumb tweet in your opinion? Comment down below and let me know, and Rhino, what you think. And also, subscribe to my channel and Rye's channel as well. And hope we will see you guys in the next video. God bless you, Rock. Don't forget Peace. it. Peace.